So guys, what is going on? Vasil Lomachenko will take on Luke Campbell uh, August 31st uh, at the O2 Arena, uh, at the O2 Arena live on pay-per-view. Um, Vasil Lomachenko will be coming to the UK. The best pound for pound fighter will be fighting in the UK. Um, it's great news for us UK fans. Um, however, uh, the fight's on pay-per-view. I don't know how that's going to go down with the fight fans. Is Vasil Lomachenko v Luke Campbell a pay-per-view fight? I don't know. Um, to be honest with you, yes, Lomachenko is one of the best pound-for-pound -pound fighters in the world. But is it a pay-per-view fight? I'm not, I'm, I'm uh, you know, I'm excited or not excited, intrigued uh, to hear what you guys have to say about this being a pay-per-view fight. But I guess to get Lomachenko over, you need it to be on pay-per-view to generate their funds in order to pay him. So I understand why they've got it on pay-per-view. Uh, it's all right for us hardcores, but I can't see many casuals buying that. Many casuals won't know who Lomachenko is. And Luke Campbell's not that well-known either. So, yeah, although he's an Olympic medalist, Campbell, I still think that, you know, his profile's not that uh, high for it to be a pay-per-view event. Yes, Lomachenko is one of the best pound-for-pound -pound fighters in the world. I understand why they have to put it on a pay-per-view, but I also understand why I don't think this is going to be uh, a pay-per-view card that they buy unless there's a strong undercard, which we'll have to wait and see what is the, what is on there on the undercard. But I don't know what's on the undercard, but if it's not a strong undercard, I don't know whether the main event is strong enough to be a pay-per-view event because you know in order for it to be a pay-per-view event the, the the main event has to be very strong uh, and i'm not sure uh, how big a draw lomachenko is here and campbell's definitely never fought on pay-per-view here before he's not a pay-per-view fighter so again i'll leave that to you guys but in terms of the fight it's a great fight uh it's for three of the four um, lightweight titles and it's a brilliant fight against two brilliant fighters i think it's a great fight i think uh Lomachenko is obviously the favourite um, and most people would expect him to beat Campbell quite comfortably but I don't think Campbell's somebody that should be wrote off. Campbell's a very good fighter, he's tall, he's big for the weight, he's got very good skills and I, I don't think you can write Campbell off. I just don't think. I, I think he's a good fighter. I think he's a very, very good fighter, very slick, very good uh, but I just think Lomachenko is that much better. I think Lomachenko is so special. Um, he's unbelievable, Lomachenko. So I think Lomachenko is going to be hard to beat right now for, for anybody. Uh, I just think he's on another level. I think he's on another dimension to a lot of these guys. And unfortunately for Campbell, he's running in, in my, for me, the best pound for pound fighter in the world and probably the most gifted technically, fighter, most gifted technical fighter uh, that we've seen um, possibly ever, you know, in some people's eyes. He's so, so good. Uh, I wish Luke Campbell all the best. Hopefully he can do it. Hopefully he can pull it off and 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 ha you know cause a massive upset, uh, as we saw with Ruiz and Joshua. Upsets do happen. However, this, in my opinion, this will be a bigger upset. Even though Campbell's really really good, Lomachenko is so so good and he's so technically gifted. Joshua, sh you could see vulnerabilities with Lomachenko. There's no real vulnerabilities. He's so good. He's so so good. Um, it's going to be hard for Luke Campbell to win this fight. You know, how much I, I want him to win so badly for British boxing, it'll be unbelievable if he pulls it off. Can you imagine what it does for British boxing? We'll have a unified lightweight champion, you know, which is only good for the sport in the UK. But being realistic, Lomachenko is a genius, and I just don't see anybody beating him right now. I think he's on another level to most guys. and. I think he's the best fighter in the world. But leave your thoughts, guys. Let me know what you're thinking, guys. Remember to please like, share and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.